Good old Almond Gene Dewey. Icebound Planet. Welcome everybody, Gaming Mike here. We're back in No Man's Sky permadeath mode tonight. Boy, I had so much fun in the last permadeath stream. I just wanted to play some more. So, thanks for tuning in here at the regular stream time, 9 p.m. Mountain Standard, couple minutes early. That's how excited I was. Oh, we've got a Dell we can rename. Who was first in chat tonight? It was Richard Huntington. It's the Richard Huntington Dell. Richard, welcome to it, as well as Old McReaper88 and Nimrod4400 and Sam Patton. Thanks for joining us tonight. Richard Huntington Dell. Sounds like a whole different person. <laughs> Pimp and Plays, welcome, welcome. Thanks for joining. Oh, let's get to it. What are we in? We're in permadeath mode. Did I never upload this system back here? What's going on with that? Why does it seem like everything's out of order? What's going on here? There's dang main row. Dang main row. I remember. Yeah, we found all the animals there. We uploaded that. So, uh... Why is there... Undiscovered stuff here? I'm just looking at this... List. We found all the animals there. Maybe I just forgot to upload these? That's fine. Gotta get those units, though. Haha! -ha. Alright. So. We're permadeathing. Uh, how much... How much... 446,000 left. So last time, I finished repairing all the slots on my Class B shuttle. From the Crater of Doom. Uh... <laughs> Ah, uh, this old baby. She's really coming along. I've got a, fa a cannon upgrade. I've got a shield upgrade. What else can I build here? Oh, I could build uh, an accelerated fire if I scrap up some aluminum. Hey, say, wait a second. Don't I have some aluminum? Say, I have exactly enough aluminum. Hey, Yahtzee. Let's build an accelerated fire module on this baby. Shall we? Yowza. Why not? Uh, look at that. We need a coolant, though. <laughs> We're gonna need a coolant. For sure. That thing's gonna go fast. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Thanks for coming along, though, guys. Don't forget to hit that like button if you're digging the No Man's Sky streams. Boy, yeah, last time. I finally got into some pirate fighting. I've been avoiding it up until that point, and, uh, it was just so satisfying. It was just so satisfying. I really hope I run into some more pirates tonight. We've got Viking daggers. We need Spadonium. Well, what basically now I'm going to have to set my sights on getting ship upgrades because I need Viridium and Rubium for my employees. Rubium's first. So I'm going to have to keep my eyes out for warp engine upgrades. Uh, don't need the insulating gel anymore. Actually, I need to change that. There we go. And uh, where are we sitting? Milestones. Four more planets to go. Four more planets to go for that level 10 zoology milestone, which will get us the warp drive theta eventually. But dang. Dang, main row. Look at this one. It's at a three. We got to three on the pirate uh, milestone last time. That one's going to go fast now. My Sol's in extreme conditions milestone is... Uh, sadly low. Sadly. I've done the traveling. I've done the greetings. I'm coming I'm coming along on the words. Huh. Warping is going along nicely. I need uh, manufacturing facilities and op centers as well. Oh, what do we have over in the farm? Let's go pick the plants. <laughs> These are the only things that have grown back. Oh. Wrong button. There's that Mordite. Good. So, where to head? We can continue down the Atlas path, too, while we do this. Uh, that should work well enough, I think. Punchy's Tuxedo, welcome to it. Irving John, welcome, welcome. Thanks for joining. Glad to have you along. We're just in permadeath mode. We're just figuring out 
where the teleporter is and what to do next. I don't have enough plutonium to even take off. So that's not good. I have a dynamic resonator. I can build an exocraft on any planet I go to. That's good. Daniel Hipley, welcome. I need more heridium. I need more heridium. Before we leave base. Boy, that aluminum finally came in handy. That was great. Got a stack of iridium in there, but not heridium. I have no heridium storage. Maybe we should go around home planet here and gather up some plutonium. Gather up some heridium. What do we have here? This is the nomad pad. This is my nomad. I don't want the nomad. I want the trusty old roamer. That's what I want. Yes, sir. Give it to me. There she is. Hey. All right. Oh, yeah, we got a stack of plutonium in there for fuel. That's great. Bunch of carbon, bunch of pla- Oh, look! Do have heridium. Hey! Hell, maybe I'll just take this stuff out of here. Big old stack of platinum in here, too. Why is it in the roamer? I'm gonna put it in the box. Save the carbon for charging. I'm gonna leave the plutonium in it. But if I don't need to go gathering heridium, then I'm not going to worry too much about plutonium. Because I'll find plutonium wherever I go. It's always just around the corner. Don't you know it. You just have to find the right corner. Good thing I scanned those plants already. Almond Gene Dewey. This has been a good base planet. Take the big one, says Punchies. No, I don't need it. No. I don't mess much with the Colossus because, boy, is it slow. Boy, oh boy. Is it ever? Boy, boy. I could start a heridium stack. No, I'll be using this as soon as I make planet fall. Well, I don't know. I will use that heridium, though. I will use it. That is a full stack of platinum in the box. Oh, my goodness. All right. So, the furthest system we've gone to... Oh, excuse me, can I get up the ramp, please? <laughs> Doesn't need to be the furthest. I think there was one, an Atlas Station one away from Dang, Marie, Ma Dang Main Row. Dang Main Row. Let's go back. Let's go back to Dang Main Row. And see if there's an Atlas Interface one system away, or if I'm remembering incorrectly. Thanks for joining, everybody. Welcome to it. Appreciate you guys hitting that like button. Let's me know what's good on the channel. Glad to have you along, and thanks for being there in the chat, too. Feel free to say hey if you haven't already. Boom. Yeah, I was thinking about playing some more Uncharted 3 tonight, but boy, I just really wanted to get back to space. Space 1 over Nathan Drake tonight. In my heart and in my mind. That's okay. I've been having a lot of fun with that series. I'm gonna need to order number 4 soon. <laughs> I think I'm probably about halfway through number three, chapter-wise. Somebody in the chat was saying there were 22 chapters when I was playing it the other day. And that's that's pretty much in line with the other two games. I think there were 22 and 24 chapters in games one and two. I don't know. Something like that. I'll take that. Oh, I don't have the nanites to buy anything, but let's just remember what this guy has. Maybe he has a coolant for my photon cannons. He doesn't. He's got a... Ooh. He's got the plus two accelerated fire. Ooh. What'd you call me? Hello, Viking. What do they have here? Chrysanite, titanium, plutonium, teramin. Oh, look, it's Nurse Bo. Hello, Nurse Bo. This guy's got a nice ship. Oh, yeah, I need to check what my trade value is on my ship now that it's all repaired anyway. What you got, Prospector, Prospector Yirar? He's got a C-Class Explorer with 22 slots. The same amount of slots, and it's worth 1.3 million more than my B-Class Shuttle. Yeesh. 
Why is the Explorer class so fancy? I already know. I don't even know. It's got plus eight to its hyperdrive. That is valuable. I don't have the 1.23 million anywhere. 1.32 million. Samuel Fisher, welcome. I missed most of the last streams. Nimrod, that's okay. But uh, the last one was pretty good for pirate fighting. I finally got into it. It was pretty fun. C-Class Explorer. 1.3 million more. Look at this guy's Explorer class. I do need to start looking into an Explorer class. I guess... Uh, I spent all that money repairing slots. I'm gonna need to make I'm gonna need to make more money. I'm gonna need to make more money. This one's only five hundred and twenty thousand more. It's two slots less. And look at everything's all scrunched up up there. That sucks. I don't like that. <laughs> Get out of here. Look at this shuttle. Yeah, I'm gonna need to need to save up money and uh, get another ship. That ship is slick. You like him, Irving John? Uh, John, how far have you gotten in your No Man's Sky adventure so far? I haven't, uh, I haven't seen you stream it for a couple days. I don't know if I've missed them. Or if you've just been playing too much Destiny. This is a C-Class. Oh, I could get this one for free. Oh, it's got less slots than mine. Get out of here. Get out. Get. Skedaddle. Ooh, look at this baby. I like those, uh, side components on these ships. The curved wing around the, the globey thing. V2099, welcome to it. Need to shop for ships on planet at trade platform, Samuel Fisher. Why? What's the difference? What's the diff? 1.8 million for one more slot? Are you kidding me? And it's a, well, it's an Explorer class. Those are way more expensive, apparently. Ooh, plus 13 to hyperdrive capacity. Wowie. That's a nice one. I like that. Anyway, I'm not going to buy a ship right now. So let's get out of here. John tends to stay on one planet for a really long time. You finally managed to warp to another system, though. Nice. Nice. So you're off on the adventure. <laughs> That's great, man. It's been fun watching you play it. Somebody playing for the first time after all this time. I'm so used to this game that seeing it, you know, through fresh eyes is uh, it's kind of a trip. This is the Gek system. Oh, wait. Did I have? Yep. One jump in the chamber. Just been exploring off stream so fun. Yeah, nice. That's good that you're getting it played, though. That's good. Better chance for ships with better hyperdrives and components, too? Really, Samuel Fisher? I did not know that. I didn't know you had better odds at a trade platform. Massive dynamic. Welcome to it. Uh, let's see. I can't go that far. I really do need to upgrade my hyperdrive though. I'm gonna have to make some money. Three planets, one moon. Let's do it. I'm thinking once I finish this Atlas path, I will be able to just... I'm just gonna sell all my Atlas stones. I'm not gonna bother creating my own star. Spoiler alert. But uh... <laughs> Yeah, I'm just going to sell my Atlas Stones and make a grip of money. Although, from what I understand, they've lowered the prices on Atlas Stones since the Pathfinder update, which is a bummer. Ooh, I like that planet. There's some freighters. What do we have here? Already discovered? What the hell are you talking about? Uh-oh. Did I just waste a warp? Hold on here. I didn't look. I didn't even look at the discovery. Discovered by me on May 19th. Ah, oh, blast it. I've already been this way. Discovered by me. Dang, main row was further back on my path. Okay, I haven't discovered that one, but I have discovered this one. Token Zemar. Was that connected to my system, though? When did I discover this? The 19th. But what? <laughs> Huh. Well, I should have been paying more attention. Kind of a waste of a warp jump. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'm not connected to it anymore. Hmm. Just picked up a 43-slot hauler from a crash site in Permadeath. Nice, Samuel. 
you're working on setting up your farm to make some easy uh, credits to get to the top of the line explorer yeah that's pretty much my plan too I need to trade up to a uh, an explorer class with good warp drives that's all you can do I mean that's the way oh where am I this galactic map though don't forget to play with it sometimes. What is this? Why is that highlighted? Is that my base? All my base? All my base. Yeah, that's where my base is. That's why it's highlighted. Anyway, hyperdrive has no fuel, so we're going to need to fly into station anyway. Hello, space station. Hello, round number nine, space station. Hello, big round number nine. I forgot to look at what type of system this is. Dang, main row. I love that system name. Number nine. Number nine. GTX 970, welcome to it. Played a game on Steam called The Long Journey Home, and you prefer No Man's Sky much more? Right on. I never played that one, but I also prefer No Man's Sky over that one. <laughs> Oh man, looks massive. Yeah, these space stations are huge. Ivy Mike, welcome to it. Yep, yeah, episode 30. Episode 30. I'm heading down the Atlas path. I'm going to have to buy up some uh, suspension fluid. I'm going to have to grind out some warp cells. Which means I'm probably going to have to make planet fall and go gather some resources. Welcome to the new viewers, well and though. Holy cow. P Pallet PC, welcome to it. Thanks for coming along, y'all. Iceman, welcome, welcome. Appreciate you guys joining. Don't forget to hit that like button if you're digging the No Man's Sky streams. Permadeath. Look at that hole. Ah. Seen a rig that can hold that tank. Ah. With apologies to Nimra and any other Australians in the chat. Or watching at all. Ever. <laughs> What's this guy got? Hilauten. Lauten. <clears throat> Let's see. Deflection enhancement. He's got a shield upgrade. A plus one. I already have the plus two. Oh, he's got the cooling. He's got advanced cooling. Tau. 230 nanite clusters. Uh, yeah, GTX 970, Perception. We've talked about that on Jolt. That's a show I do on Sundays with my buddy AC Gamer. We talk about game news. And uh, that one looks really interesting. I haven't played that either, but it looked uh, Perception looked really curious as a concept. <laughs> oh, premium suspension fluid. You're killing me. Because he knows what I need. Trade terminal knows what you need. And then puts it on a premium. I know it, I swear. Where are all the traitors? Where are all the traitors? Okay. For... I need that suspension fluid formula. That's what I really, really need. Let's see if there's any op centers or manufacturing facilities to scan up in this system. Oh, look out, buddy. Planet base detected. And anything else? Abandoned building detected. I can get some nanites there. If it, how far away is it? Just on this moon? Let's go gather some nanites. Wait, we won't be able to lift off if we do that. Ah! Pirates! <laughs> Come on, you stinkers. Oh, I'm ready for you, Sunny Jim. What do you got? The stress signal. Oh, great. You guys want to do a freighter battle? Here they come. Are they going to fly right by me? Fly right by me, you pirates. Where'd they go? Well, there's three up there. Well, there's three up there. Aussie and Lord, welcome to it. Space Wars. Alright. Can I... Nope. 
local enemy disruption. I can't go any faster. Come on, you shuttle. Would love to know my ship type. Xavier, welcome to the chat. I've got this Class B shuttle. It's not much to look at, but it's really growing on me. I've got one shield upgrade, one photon, no, two photon cannon upgrades. I've got accelerated fire. Actually, that reminds me. Yeah. It's not overheating that bad, though. Not overheating that bad. Why are they so far away? <laughs> Get back here! I thought the pirates usually come flying right by you when there's these space battles, though, and they didn't do it that time. What do you do with a drunken sailor? Wow, Lollipop Wasical, welcome to the chat. Friend of Ossian, are you? Why did it make me go be so far away from them? I want to fight now. Oh, I can't use my pulse engine. This is the worst. This doesn't seem right that it's making me go so slow. Her eye in the morning. But if I can get to these pirates and then fight them off and then get my reward from the freighter captain, why that should be some good unit income for me, I think, I hope. But boy. Still stuck at 165 units. Oh, now I'm going faster. Why? What was that? What was all that about? Look out! <laughs> Alright. Oof. How many? Four? Oh, five, six. That's what I'm used to. These guys all in formation. Where's those other two? I should be able to engage them in pairs, yes? Look at these four. Oh, God. <laughs> and I have to make real, real sure not to shoot that freighter. Because holy cow, that'll end me. Oh, I missed. And I gotta make sure not to shoot any of these other friggin' traitors that are rolling around either. Alright. All these two. There we go. There we go. Oh, it's about to engage. Oh, don't hit the freighters. Take him down. Take him down. There. Oh, these new photon cannons are working just fine. Boom. Where? Here. There's two over there. Oh, they're after me. Where'd they go? I'm losing them. Oh. They're shooting me. Who's firing? Got that one. Come here. Come here. Where are you? Where are you? There he is. Get over here. You don't know anything. We're Jon Snow. Jon Snow. Boom. Got your trophy. Where? Where are they? Boom. Oh, look out now. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can't tell what's going on. There's too many friggin' innocents over there. Plus, the freighter fire was <laughs> scaring me. I don't know if that freighter was firing at me or what. There he goes. Get over here. Get over here. Ah! Freighter! There he is. Oh, get over here, you punk. Ooh, maybe I'll upgrade to a fighter class ship <laughs> instead of an explorer class. I can still head towards the center in a fighter. Uh, love it. Yes. 
Man, I can't believe I went so long without doing any space fighting in this game. Y'all, fight pirates! Hit that like button if you enjoyed that. I know I did. Gets the blood pumping. Gets the blood pumping. Whew. Lordy. Let's go get our reward. I need that money. Hand me them ducats. <laughs> if you play Grand Theft Auto 3, pass me them ducats. Do I like positron ejectors? Massive dynamic. I've played with all the weapons, but not... Um, a lot. Oh my gosh. Let's see. DJ Darkside, welcome to the chat. Saw you join there. I'm just catching up a little bit. Looks like you guys did enjoy that. Good, good, good. Oh my goodness sakes. Nurse Bo knows I'm all about getting the blood pumping. Right, Nurse Bo? Right? Right? <laughs> freighters. Oh yeah, you don't lose uh, life support in freighters just like space stations, right? That's great. Thanks for being so life supportive, you freighter. That's the back side. We need to go to the front. Oh my goodness. Pirate battles. What kind of reward do you get in permadeath? This is my first time in permadeath. Be gentle with me. Captain, Hilo kill you. Hilo kill you! <laughs> Thank you, friend. You have my appreciation. Can I offer you a reward? Yes. Take supplies. Thanks, bud. Aha! Titanium. Sweet. Antimatter. Add a boy. That's what I want. Oh, that's pretty good. I was hoping for a bunch of units. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Iceman, I did not see your nanite farming episode. I'll have to check that out. Yep, Samuel Fisher, you were right. Uh, let's see, how much are the freighters? 17 million or so for the first, or 7 million? 19 million. Yeah, it's been a while since I went freighter shopping. This one looks cool. Too bad I can't afford it. <laughs> Using piracy. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, I think I watched you stream some of that. You were doing that. You were uh, attacking freighters. That's right. I watched you stream some of it. Um, and yeah, that seemed very effective for nanites. Indeed. Absolutely. Whoa, man. So. Freighter battle. Got some tropium. Got enough to make a warp cell. We can fuel the hyperdrive. That means we could get on down the road if we wanted. Get on down the road. I don't care you. <laughs> Once Sentinels are on you in space, can you ditch them? I think you can land again, Ivy Mike, and then run away from whatever comes at you on the land and ditch them that long way. I don't know about ditching them in space. It's been so long since I fought Sentinels in space in any mode. It's been a very long time. Let's go to this abandoned building like we were going to. Kapiao! And away we go, away we go. Glad to see me taking a break from the brain explosion. Sean, yeah, well, welcome to the chat, first of all, and second of all, thanks, yes. Uh, some permadeath was in order tonight. I was feeling it, I was feeling it. And that pirate battle was exactly what I wanted. Doomtooth Gosnell, welcome to the chat. I love your YouTube name. That's great. And welcome everybody else rolling in. Appreciate you joining here on Gaming Mike's channel. Don't forget to hit that like button if you're enjoying yourself. And uh, feel free to subscribe for more in the future too. I do like to play the No Man's Sky as well as some other stuff. Uncharted 3 lately. Elder Scrolls. Etc. There's no markers by abandoned buildings. I don't have plutonium. If I land here, I'm here for a minute. This one looks... Like it has a chance of being hostile in one way or another. Uh, any sign of plutonium in the vicinity? Y'all got plutonium? I can find something nearby that may have a landing pad and come back to this abandoned building once I find out what the planet's like. That would be cautious. Gonna have a lot of underwater markers here, aren't we? Yes. Yes. 
Nope, that's a trading post. Oh, great. That's really far away. That means it's a trading post. I thought it was in the water, but it's not. <laughs> Samuel Fisher says, don't do it. Don't do what? Don't land? Sean says, boo. <laughs> Iceman says, get into a black hole system. Get into a black hole system for what? Black hole for what? Oh, I'm going to lose that. Oh, no. You can't do question marks like this, can you? Or can you? If I go back onto the planet, is it going to show me that question mark again? I was thinking it was a marker, a regular old marker I was flying to. It was not. Being lazy. Being sloppy. But there's something. Is that it? I doubt that's it. That's not it, is it? That can't be it. Is it a trading post? Nope. Lost it. That's a bummer. That was dumb. That was dumb. What's this? That's my abandoned building, though. Trading post may be on the way back there. You never know. Oh, look out for those trees. Check these islands, yo. These floating islands. Heck. This planet's rad. Those two are real close together. Real close. Nurse Bo seen like six of my other videos today. Well, thanks for watching, man. If I land at the post, I'll be fine. Massive dynamic. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But then I lost the trading post. Oh, photo bubble. Man. I like the look of this planet a lot. It's pretty neat. Chicken's permission. Welcome to it. Bone junkie as well. Welcome, welcome. No signs of plutonium. Look at this square. Look at the pop in. The textures. Whoops. I can see through you. I can see right through you. I know what's under there. Nothing. Except that rock. What's that rock doing buried in there? Get out of there. <laughs> Funny. The texture didn't quite make it to the ground. Head the way you were heading, certain to run across it again. That's what I was thinking, Samuel Fisher. I'll just head back to the abandoned building. Watch it be radioactive, says DJ Darkside. I hope not. Taking a break from theory crafting, kicking back. Nice, Sean. Nice. Yeah. You need a break from the theorying. The, the theorizing, the, uh, the speculation. So your brain doesn't explode. <laughs> what do we have there? Okay. Nothing. I push the mark on that scan. Why? Why? Pod. Hey, I can afford that. Hey, but what about plutonium? Hey, I shouldn't land yet. Goodness sakes, don't get distracted. Don't be hasty. That's how you die in permadeath. By not listening to the advice of the Ents. What is that? Gold? Is that gold in them Nar Hills? Yeah, it is. Too bad I haven't built a phase beam. Got gold, y'all. Got gold. Is that that same place I just was? Yeah, it's that same drop pot. <laughs> Gribble Grunger, welcome to it. Moon Machine, welcome to it. Mystical Nick, welcome to it. If they add faction battles, you're getting this game right on, Mystical Nick. Good to have a goal. Miss notification? No. Oh, Moon Machine, you missed it. I did a freighter battle. It was great. I thought of you the whole time. <laughs> Do 
you get the game, they will add faction battle. There you go, Ivy Mike. If you get it, they'll add faction battles. If enough people get the game, they'll add everything that everybody wants. Yet drop pods. One, two. No sign of that trading post this time. Oh, there's a beacon that would help me find a landing pad, but I wouldn't be able to take off again. I haven't seen any Pluto. I haven't really been looking or giving it a chance to load in. Wait a second. What's that red glow? What's all that reddish glow down there? Why is it glowing red? Is that some weird shadow? That's the shadow of my ship. And it's just red grass. It's not a glow. False alarm. False alarm. I don't know. Moon Machine's so proud. Good. Good. It was a fun freighter battle. <laughs> Want to see what they plan on doing with third person viewing? I hope we get it at least for our ships. It would be nice to see outside your ship while you fly. I'll give you that. I don't really... Uh, I mean, third-person view in this game is not going to blow my skirt up very much. I'll say that. I don't think it's necessary. I don't see what the advantage would be of being able to see our characters. But I know a lot of people want it. And it wouldn't... I, it wouldn't do... It wouldn't be a detriment to the game at all. I would just... It's something I probably wouldn't use. Unless it had some particular advantage. I like the first person view. I like the... Oh! I found another one just like that the other day. Same stairs, same type. There's a monolith right by that abandoned building, though. I'd like to remember that for when I find plutonium. Look at this column of rock, too. What's it doing? Rygogen. We got Rygogen. This one spawned its own little island. Starships and monoliths. And everything between. You want a first person in the buggy, Ivy Mike? That'd be fun. Check for red boxes by the beacon. Oh yeah, there's yeah, there's those boxes I could find all over. I just don't know what this planet's gonna be like yet. I just don't even know. Get ready for VR support. That would be awesome. Reckon it will make climbing look janky. I'd sooner they didn't. Yeah, that's a good point, Gribble. <laughs> Someone take my money if they add VR, says Iceman. VR in this game would be cool. I... I Man, if they went full-blown VR with this game, I just might go ahead and get the PlayStation VR. I think that would put me over the edge on that one. No Man's Sky VR. Yeah, that would be worth it. That would be worth it. Plaque. Plaque. Yeah, right. Spaceships and monoliths. Abandoned buildings. So, uh... Heck. Maybe I'll just land. What if it's hostile sentinels? Well, then we'll really have something to cry about, won't we? Here we go. Screw it. <laughs> Plasma Blitz, welcome to it. Oh, you're finally caught up on the permit of the streams. Nice. Oh, humid. Yep. Frenzied Sentinels. Sure enough. Shit. Megan Hercuni 6. Extreme Sentinel Planet. Yeah. Extreme Sentinel Planet. Extreme. I had like 150 plutonium, so I don't need to gather a ton of it. Oh, my health is at maximum. Great. Didn't even check for carbon whips, but I haven't been smacked in the head yet, so I guess I'm good on that. <laughs> oh, man. 
VR HUDless Moon Machine, that'd be the ultimate. That would be the ultimate. When VR support happens, your life is over, Sean. <laughs> Pretty much. Oh, man. Nice grass equals pain in the ass. That's right, Ivy Mike. Chicken's permission would love to find a planet like this. You want to trade? Frenzied Sentinels. A convergence cube. A convergence cube. How much plutonium? 165. Oh, baby. Oh, look at this guy. There's the space... There's the planet's bully. Scan him. Oh, hey, buddy. Excuse me. Do you mind? Yo, what are you doing? I can't shoot you in here, guy. Great. <laughs> there he goes. Yep, right on me. Yep. Hasn't activated, though. What? 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 You punk. Let's see if we can get him trapped in the building. Because he's stupid. Hey, you're stupid. Viking dagger. Can I get the save? Durzu, Dr. Zoo Forest. Durzu, Zru, Zru Forest. Oh, get out of here. Yeep. <laughs> What do you want? You are a jerk. <laughs> Shoot plaques, get sentinel planets. Yeah, that's what I get. What's the mission at the sec, dude? I'm uh, just, I'm, I'm running down the atlas path. I'm gathering stuff. I'm doing what I can right now. No direct ex immediate mission. This is the most hectic you've ever seen this game. Hurry and get the gas before the sentinels come, Laz. Welcome to the chat. Be a Corvax in no man's sky third person. That'd be weird. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Welcome to the new viewers rolling in. Don't forget to hit that like button, y'all, if you're digging it. Why does that rock look like a geck? It's a flight. It's a field. It's a field. Why does it look like a geck that's sitting down looking at its toes? Get out of here, geck rock. I'm going to take some free units right now while I scan some stuff. Here comes the sentinel. Get out of here. Jon Snow, you know nothing. <laughs> and then I'll poke my head out this door and scan some plants. Oh. Uh, excuse me, I'm trying to... Excuse me, there's a... There's a space cow over there. Rukachula Wihalo. Oh, it's not so hectic. I'm just scanning some rocks and plants, that's all. That's not too hectic. Blue sphere grass and geck rocks, kind of cool. Yeah, this planet's pretty rad. Too bad about the frenzied sentinels. It's like a puppy with lasers. <laughs> that was a weird rock. Way weird. So some things look like races or have faces in the game. Plasma blitz, yeah, it happens. You start seeing stuff. You start seeing stuff for sure. received, baby. Missed the landing. What's this planet sentinels like? Frenzied sentinels, Ossian. Frenzied sentinels. They're in a frenzy. What is that broken thing? That's weird looking. Is that a tree or a rock? Aphronite. It's probably a rock. Huh. It's a rock that looks like a tree. It's a friggin' pseudo wudo, y'all. Have I been calling everything Jon Snow? Yeah, tonight I have, Nurse Bo. Tonight I have. Because none of it knows anything. Oh wait, how big was the animal list? 
It's a pretty big list. I don't think I'll be stopping for the whole thing. Anyway, who wants a forest named after them? Say I do in the chat. First one to say I do gets a waypoint named after them right now. Ready, set, go. I'm gonna scan some more things. Where are those red dots? Are they over the hill? Nope. Oh, there he is. Predator. Where'd that other red dot go? Adult female temperament timid. That's not a predator. Oh, that's the other Rukata Wihalo. Rukata Wihalo. Oh, dang. That was fast, you guys. Who said it first? Samuel Fisher. Guess you need to find some... Uh-oh. Ugh. <laughs> Guess you need to find some of the grab orbs that are obviously on this planet and pick them up. Yeah, there should be something like that, right? I should name it Jon Snow Samuel Fisher. Uh, as you wish. This will be the Jon Snow Forest. That's your waypoint. You can choose to rename it something else if you like. <laughs> there we go. Jon Snow Forest. Somebody will find that someday, and boy, won't they just be so curious about why I was such a Game of Thrones fan. Little do they know. Wavi. Wavige Nektaku. That's the predator. And then the next one. Rukatula Uihalo. That's. They're timid. The next one down the list is the timid one. Right after the predator. They look similar though. I mean a little bit. Not not real similar. They're both dino bodies. <coughs> Dang lag. Yeah, don't forget to hit the live button to make sure you're caught up in the stream from time to time. Sometimes YouTube buffers. Oh my, look at him. You're a good sentinel. Look at you. So dutiful. There's some detritum. Oh, I see the platinum plant. Great. Is that a tree or a rock? Oh, it's rocks in front of a tree. Oh, I don't think I've scanned that. I have. These? Yep. Looks like I've scanned almost everything. Oh, Antrium. Haven't scanned that yet. <laughs> Rakatula's a looker. <laughs> A real looker. Oh, I didn't scan this yet. Oh. You doing battle? Are you doing battle? Oh, get, that's the other gender. Oh, red dot that way. Come up over the hill there, fella. Is that the predator? Scan the animal, not the building. Scan the animal. Volatile. You're too volatile to live, sir. That's gonna send the sentinel. No, that didn't send the sentinels after me. What's up with that? Frenzied my foot. Oh, greatest storm. Oh, they all turned green. Uh oh. You didn't see me. You didn't see me. <laughs> Storm's not that bad. Negative 46? That's not that bad at all. Oh, oh, you saw me. Don't shoot me. You're the worst. You're the worst. Get out of my face. I think that dino killed that new creature. Nope, it's running away. Get him, get him. Scan it. Oh, scan it. Ah! Where's he running? He's behind the hill. He's behind the dang hill. I'm running over there. Where'd he go? There's the Thamium. There he is. There he is. There's the carbon whip. You getting bullied out here, buddy? Oh no. Oh no, don't look at me. Oh no! Yeah! Oh. Oh. 
Where is he? Take that. Oh no, the predator. Oh no, the predator sees me. Oh no, I can't back into the building. Oh no. What am I doing? No free slots. No way. Oh yeah, because I picked all this stuff up. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Yeah, lots of red dots still around. One of those animals had a big old booty. You would notice, Laz. <laughs> you would notice. Don't forget to do everything also. Yes, you're right. Like Nicki Minaj. <laughs> oh, that's the end. Alright, so... We shouldn't have to worry about sentinels for a minute in the area, maybe. Predator, though. Oh, hey buddy. You green dot? Yeah. You the other gender? Yeah. Oh, little guys. Where are you scampering to? You scamps? They both turn green, good. Oh my goodness, everything is everywhere. Everything is everywhere. Oh, a bunch of them turned green. This guy. Get him. Oh, yeah, more of them turned green. I love it. I love it when a bunch of red dots turn green. It's a good feeling. One of the best. Holy cow, how many animals was that? Oh, hey! Wasn't even looking up. Boom! All green. Holy cow. Oh, what's this? Where's a red? Insect. Or is it a fish? Is that out in the water? Oh, maybe I shouldn't do this. <laughs> is he on the other side? I hear a sentinel coming. He's on the other side. Oh, I missed. Oh. Oh! Oh, there he is. Oh, baby. You're nasty. I gotta get a photo, y'all. Ew. Ew. Seems like I've been seeing a lot more of this type of mouth on fishes in streams lately as well. And flying animals, for that matter. Ew. Ew. Look at that. Oh, nighttime. Sick. You're gross. You make me sick. <laughs> oh, lordy. Look at that beastie. Let's see. Catch up on the chat really fast. Hashtag sick burn. That's right. Fabian Escobar, welcome to the chat. This planet doesn't look as bad in a storm. I remember E3 revealing all fairness. Hello Games have a point. It's like a 1,000 to 1 to find a planet like they showed off. It's just a shame people hated it. I agree, Plasma Blitz. People don't really understand uh, low odds, it seems like. Looks like something in the water over there. Yeah, I found it. Chicken's permission. Holy cow. The birds always catch you out. Who looks up nowadays? Yeah, Plasma Blitz. You have to remember. <laughs> Ossian, yeah, that's pretty accurate. Looks like a bork fish. A bork, bork fish. Kill it. I don't want to kill it. It didn't do anything. It's just cruising around in the water being super gross. Super disgusto. Little rock scans? No? Nope. Little ones don't scan. a new thing. Borkfish. Splish splash. Can't scan those blue rocks either. Alright, how are we doing on this list? Oh, only four more to find. Heck. Heck. <laughs> Dental whale. 
<laughs> I like that pallet PC. Yeah, Samuel Fisher, four more to find. Found one in the water. That's this guy, right? Augmatium Adflagan. Augmatium Adflagan. Asymmetric, unpredictable carnivore. He is a predator fish. And then Ziza something. Ziza Tui. Kiviusmosi. Kiviusmosi. Yeah, so probably one or two more flying types. And then... Let's see, is it water and then cave? Or is it cave and then water? It would be cool if you could actually eat the animal from your kill. Yeah, I'm going to eat some borkfish. <laughs> the nice looking planet where I am, Plasma Blitz? Yes. Bork. Maybe I shouldn't say that. What if that's just a slang term that you're using and I don't recognize it? Oh, is that the zinc? Nope. Oh, it's a freaking carbon whip. You little bastard. Oh, <laughs> uh, what a jerk. Let's see. Oh, that island's full of life. Yeah, I hear you, Sentinel. I know this game. This is the game we call Don't Let the Sentinel Look You in the Eyeballs. Because if they don't make eye contact, I guess when they're frenzied, the eye contact thing still works. Because they don't, they don't go aggro. They haven't gone aggro on this planet until I looked them in the face. That's going to be a big one. Yep. Yeah, yeah. What's that one called? Kurotidag Zybera. Where did he fall? Right there on the list. Kurotidag. Cave is usually last, you think, Sam Fisher? That sounds right. How does a fish eat you? By vacuuming you up? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Find any plutonium? No, not really. I haven't been looking, Samuel. I've been so distracted by, uh, by all these animals and discoveries. <laughs> I forgot that I'm here for plutonium. I forgot that's... No! Don't look me in the eye. Uh, green dot. Whoa! Any fish out there? Oh! Oh, that's the timid one. Oh, sorry, dude. I thought you were your cousin. Uh-oh. John Snow Forest. Oh no. Oh, I'm gonna jump right into a friggin' predator. Oh, did I not reload? Oh, he called for backup. Where's the other one? Plants in the way. Getting lots of zinc. Where'd those other canisters go? Oh, comes their buddy. Life support 50%. I never picked up this one from earlier. Give me that. Red dots. Oh my. Okay, let's go in here so nothing messes with me for a minute. Making a stack of neutrinos. Got some nanite clusters. Getting a lot of pugnium and mordite that I don't care about. Titanium stocks rebuilding though. That's good. Filling up my zinc. That's good. That's good. I still need plutonium though. Still need plutonium. Space jerk carbon whip. <laughs> if you 
eat a bork fish, do you turn into a Swedish chef? <laughs> Richard Huntington, oh my goodness. Rename it bork fish. Alright, I'm doing it. I'm gonna rename that one the bork fish. Okay? It's done. It's done. That name is sticking forever. I don't usually rename the animals, but, uh. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> there you go. What's the mission right now, Massive Dynamic? I need plutonium to take off from this planet, but I, I think I'm going to go for all the animals here. I've only got three more, and I'll get 300,000 units for that, and I do need units. I do. Plus, I'm going to get a bunch of units when I upload all this stuff. A bunch. A bunch. Holy cow. Okay, so the last two on the list should be cave animals then, right? Land, flying, water cave? Or is it cave water? Oh, I forgot. I forgot the... Why can I never keep that straight? What's the milestone? Spirited. Oh, there. Nice. That was my 1.1 day. See, I just landed on this planet for the first time, and I was 1.1 away. If you saw in the list earlier on my discoveries, or I mean milestones, I was 1.1 sols away from my next milestone. I just landed on this planet and I got it. So I, people have said before that it doesn't carry over, but I'm quite sure that it does. And I'm pretty sure that's proof. I don't know, check my math on it if you want, but uh, I think your extreme solves, it doesn't matter if you leave a planet or leave the planet you're on and go back. I think it just counts from the time you land on an extreme planet to the time you take off. Whatever time you're there counts towards your goal. I'm, I'm certain of it. I'm certain of it. Coming up on nighttime too, so we'll check this lake for night fish. Ah! Fighter of the day fish. Oh! Gore, blimey! There's some. Champion of the sun. Is this enough to stand on? It is, just barely. And get my breath back. And do a boosty jump. You feel my life support. Oh. Get out of here. That was good. Ran out of the building. Found a fish. That's timid. I don't need to worry about you. Champion of the sun, 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 sun. He's a master of karate. Friendship for everyone. Oh my goodness. It just resets when you die, which isn't a problem in perma. Oh, okay, Moon Machine. It only resets when you die, huh? That's how you achieve the soul's goal. Palette PC, yeah, that's the way to do it. Messed up looking jellyfish things. <laughs> that's right. Laszlo knows the song. Look at that bug eyed freak. Exotic, fearful. Eats oxide elements. Where is he on the list? He's not the last. So it's probably another fish, I'm thinking. Scott Delaney, welcome. Haven't seen you in a bit. Nice to see you again. I feel like if they add a character model, he, she is going to be very short, Ivy Mike. Yeah. Seems like it, huh? Like a geck. Like a friggin' geck. Probably another bird and probably another fish, don't you think? Don't y'all think? Probably a night bird. I still need plutonium for crying out loud. And some thamium would be nice. Have I scanned? Oh, there's another canister. Nanites. Great. Oh, thamium that way? Good. Predator. Get out of here. Get out. Oh, over the cave. There are caves here too, though. I shouldn't neglect. This wasn't much of a cave. This wasn't much of a cave at all. But caves do form on the planet, so... I'll have to keep an eye out. 
see this list again. Which one was the flying type? This guy? Zizetue. And he's there. And Hiroto Diag was this guy. The big one. So between the big one and a flying type, it's probably going to be a flying type. <laughs> oh, man. Shift is done. Time to flee the office. See you later, Richard Huntington. Thanks for stopping by. Don't forget to hit that like button on your way out. And welcome to the new viewers as well. Did I ever disassemble the scanner booster and put it next to the scanner, Scott Delaney? No, I did not. I did not do that. I have not reconfigured my multi-tool. I unlocked a few extra slots and built up my laser. But I have not done a proper rebuild of those scanner components. It's on my list. Oh, hey, oh, get out of here. Nighttime is falling. I'm going to have to go check up on those floating islands, too. If I don't find them all down on the ground here. Hey, little creatures. You seen any red dots around? I saw a fish out this way. There's a green dot and a white dot here. What's the white dot? That looks like it wants to be the big eel, right? The big dangerous eel. Yeah, he's still swimming around over there. Is that a carbon whip? You stinker. You absolute stinker. Oh, stop it. Oh, stop it. You don't know me, Sentinel. You don't know me. You want to do this? Did you call for friends? No. Jeez. Get out of here. Eh? Oh. It's just the... The bork fish. It's just the bork fish after me. Yeah. Oh, hit the ground. Uh oh, Borkfish is giving chase. What is that? What? What was that white dot? I came all the way out here for. What was it? Uh oh, Borkfish. Don't get eaten. Oh no, a sheer cliff face. Oh, jetpack, don't fail me. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. Lovely view. <gasps> Bunch of dots over there. Nothing swimming. It's storming at nighttime, though. Now's the time to look. Oh. Bork fish. You're the borkiest. Alright, we need to get back to where there's actually animals around, though. Yeah! I hope it's deep enough! Oh! Found you. Green dots. You're all a bunch of green dots. Fast moving bork fish over there. I know. It's so tempered. I think this storm will be over before my shields run out. 
Sorry, I'm losing track of the chat, but I just want to really search well while it's nighttime and storming right now. That's going to be my best bet for finding anything I haven't seen yet, I think. But there's not much around here. Oh, Thamium. That is a big carbon whip. Holy shit. Look at the size of this one. It looks bigger, doesn't it? This seems bigger than most. Oh, what? Oh, what is it? You clamming? Maybe the storm's not going to end before my shields run out. And I've transferred all my... fine. We're fine. Oh, ho, see? It would have been just enough. It would have been just enough. Fork fish over there. Man, oh man. Let's check for cave creatures. This seems like a likely place if there are any. Hopefully it's not angry crabs. Oh, lordy. Let me check the chat real quick. <laughs> Fly high up. Welcome to the chat. Let's see. Thought you would since it increases the amount of boost if it is next to the scanner. Yeah, Scott Delaney. It's on my list. Wonder if there's a deep sea creature plasma blitz. Could be. Could be. How long will I be streaming for now? Just curious. When it's early morning here, I should be asleep. I'll be streaming for a while, plasma blitz. Thought it was the sound you make when you heave. Fixed the water impact glitch. Did they? Oh, yeah, Scott. I guess they did. I didn't even think about that. But, yeah, I climbed back out after a big jump, didn't I? And didn't get hurt. Mega whip. That's right. Cave lighting, though. Yeah, that cave lighting is great. Check cave for plutonium. Yep, I still need the plutonium. Yep. Oh, there's even water in here. There's even water in the cave. I didn't realize that. Oh, zinc. Platinum. Thamium. The other type of antrium plant. Wow. This cave system, though. I love it. Green dot. Bork fish. mountain goading that I'm doing is not very safe. What do we have? Still two more? No, just, no, yeah, two more. Two more. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Large cave with water? I don't know. Cave, water, night, storm, predators, moon machine. Wouldn't that just be the way? Did I have grenade launcher glitch yet? Yeah, all the time, Scott. All the time. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, let's see. So either a fish or a cave type and then either a flying or a land type probably, right? Yeah, either a flying or a land type. That last land type I found was a really big one. I think it's going to be another flying type. Flying types are weak against electric. Electric isn't effective against ground. Etc.
Nope. Nope. Almost fell off. Sentinels don't like that. They don't want you to have fuel for your weapons. Whoa. It's fine. Sentinels, it's fine. You green dot, you're a green dot. Another valley full of animals here. Oh. Bye, Sentinel Escort. You were never wanted. Green dot. Little green dots running all over the place. Oh, he found me. Uh oh. Whoa. Oh, oh. What happened there? Maybe they didn't fix that water glitch. Dang. What was all that? Oh, good. It's another squidly. Found it. Look at him. Oh! Little army helmet. <laughs> there we go. That's the last one on the list. So probably another flying type. Sweet. Oh, my goodness. Nowhere near fauna when this happened. Says Samuel. Yeah, moon machine. It turned out to be a fish after all. Get thrown miles from the exocraft? Yeah, Samuel, I've had that happen too. It's been a while. Uh, let's see. Grover, Tennessee, welcome to the chat. Uh, might be worth building the exocraft. Nah, not for the last one. The last one's probably a flying type, so probably I need to look for uh, plutonium now. Joshua, welcome. One left, that's right. Is there any way to scan for creatures other than the sites you've already have, i.e. Exocraft or Station Beacon? Not that I know of, Plasma Blitz. There we go. Where's my ship? That way. So we need to watch the skies as we head back, and we need to always look behind us, because the birds always seem to pop in once you walk past, like, their spawn point. Like, you'll trigger them in the air, but you're, like, directly underneath them, so you don't notice it. But then you turn around, and there they are. Seems to be the way. What's that? Oh, there was a monolith. I should have been headed towards that monolith. Forgot about it. Now I don't remember which direction from the abandoned building it was in. Was it over this way? Oh. Come on, scan it. There you go. Oh. I gotta stop jumping into the water like that. Oh, I'm down. Ooh. Losing health. I'm down to four health. That's no good. I don't need to act like that. Yeah, no, water glitch not fixed. That one didn't do the animation like it ought have. Lots of stuff underwater to scan still.
Whoops. Already scanned those? Yep. All those. I need those. <laughs> Borkfish is lit fish. Yeah, getting reckless. I need to watch it. I need to watch it. I need all these monies, too. I think that looks like all the underwater rocks and plants. At least in this area. Whoa, there it is. You see it? I saw that shadow. Oh, or was that... Oh, I thought I saw... It. Borkfish faked me out. It was its silhouette underwater. I thought I was seeing a flying dragon going overhead. Curse you, Borkfish! <laughs> Where's all the dots? Fool me once, Borkfish. Where'd you go? Those things are huge. Dang, main row. You stuck in the wall there? You giant ass borkfish. Oh, it just goes right through. Those things are gigantic. What the? Oh, that hurt him. Uh oh. Nope, didn't see anything, sir. Didn't see anything at all. I was just over here doing something. Something else? Sir? Where's my ship? I was just looking for where I parked. Oh, I can't do this. There. That was a gentler trip into the water. Did it work? It worked. I didn't get hurt coming out. <laughs> Good thing I had a little jetpack left. Uh oh. Oh, that's the borkfish. Green, green, green. Green, green, green. Everything green. Uh oh. Is this the predator type? Nope, that's the timid type. Hello. You're friendly. I know that. The word for hydration. What an appropriate planet to learn that word on. Totes approps. Oh. That was a white dot way up in the air. And there's plutonium. Oh yeah, baby. This is the way. Oh, get uh That white dot. That white dot. Oh damn it. <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh, that's something up on that island. That's something up on that floating island. Or no, that column. That column of rock. Oh, do you not like that, Sentinels? Of course they are. Uh-oh. My shields were already down. Oh, from that jump. I gotta knock it off. Down to two health? Oh, yikes. No bueno, friends. No bueno. Reckless, no good. That's all the plutonium I'll ever need, though. Don't! Dweet! No, sir. No! Ah! Carbon whip! Ah! Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 There's the other gender. Hurry, scan it. There's the other gender of the giant. Oh no, that was newly discovered? That was it! That's the last animal! If I blast that plutonium, 
The sentinels will attack me. No, get out. Let's go. That was it. That's everything we need to do here, ever. There's a carbon whip. Look out. Oh, get out of here. Excuse me. I'll take this Thamium on my way. Thank you. Get me out of here. Duh. Don't be reckless. Duh. Can I scan this? Yes. That was it. Double check. Boom. That was it. Yes, it was another big one. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Rabbit hounds, welcome to it. Get to my ship, crazy person. Yep, that's what we're doing. We're done. Whips like to lurk just over hills. Yes, they do. I thought we were just naming more food. Oh, that massive dynamic. Okay, nurse bow. Shaggy do exclamations will not save you. John Otter, disagree. <laughs> welcome to the chat, though. Nice to see you. Strongly disagree. Oh, I missed. Hit that tree. Hit the tree. Oh, never scanned that. Funky little plant. Funky little plant. If you see a purple plant on your way to the beach and some dinosaurs, you should get back. Get back to your ship. Get back to your... That's the, tim that's the predator. Nope, that's the timid type. Okay. Get back, baby. Get back. Get back, baby. Back to the Jon Snow forest. Whence you came. That's a planet completed. That's number seven for the planetary discoveries. Two health left. Uh, let's upload it. Yes! Kablamo! Let's upload all these and see how much money we get. Yes! Hit that like button for completing a planet discovery list. I love it. Welcome to the new viewers also. Thanks for watching Gaming Mike's channel tonight. Hope you guys are enjoying. I really do, because this is fun. <laughs> I'm loving it. We just we just rocked the socks off of that planet. It's socks. They're gone. You wonder where your socks go in the dryer and the washer. These socks got rocked off. Out of the galaxy. Nowhere to be found. Plus the borkfish. <laughs> Getting so much money now. Heck, I'll be able to afford a ship at this rate pretty soon. All those plants, all those animals, all those sentinels restocked my zinc for me. Oh, that's great. Oh, yeah. Got a little reckless there. I'm glad I didn't die. That would have been a real bummer. I've been having a couple of really good streams, actually, with this game. Captain Juice, welcome to the chat. Gaming Mike, answer your question. I didn't see it, Captain Juice. Repeat it, if you like. Moon Machine says, great stuff, thanks. <laughs> Are Borkfish Predators massive, massive dynamic? Yes, definitely. Sounds like dead Kennedys. It was the B-52s, Laszlo. Is it that bad? Sav Jazz, welcome to the chat. Go straight to ship. Don't collect $200. Don't pass go. Yeah. Straight to ship. Caroline Holes, welcome, welcome. Ant Head Art, welcome as well. I'm on in the middle of the night. This is my regular stream time. Monday, Wednesday, Fridays is when I stream, y'all. On Gaming Mike's channel. 9 p.m. Mountain Standard. So I started about an hour and a half ago. This is my regular stream time from wherever you are watching live right now. If you're watching in the future, don't do math calculations based on what I just said, because it won't make sense. Archivist, seven planets. Perfect. What's better, Diablo 2 or 3, Captain Juice? 3. See you later, Punchy's Tuxedo. Thanks for stopping by. Scott Delaney saw the pirate battles. Way to drift him away. Nice, yes, that was fun. I had a good freighter battle at the beginning of this stream, too. It was very nice. Very lovely. Okay, you launch thrusters, eight plutonium there, and 294 there, and let's transfer the rest, oh, that was the rest, 
What? Okay. Sure. Whatever. I got a lot of carbon from all that blasting I did on the way back to ship. So that I may... Recharge these. Ten left. Nice. <clears throat> Looked like I was getting good at the maneuver. Yeah, Scott Delaney, I learned from Moon Machine. Moon Machine heard borf sh Bork Shack. <laughs> so that's good. <laughs> Moon Machine news. Scout the Invincible Nightmare. Welcome to the chat. Uh-oh, did my stream drop? Uh-oh. Hopefully the stream's working all right for everybody. Let me just... I'll hit the refresh. It seems to be working. Uh, let's see. Nah, Caroline, that'll be great if you start streaming. Let us know for sure. We'll be sure to show up for that. John Otter, I think you're cheating. Paying off Corvax to get the Atlas. Nah. How dare you, sir. <laughs> Alright. That's planet complete. We have a hyperdrive cell to get to the next system. Let's go. We did a planet here. We're on the Atlas path. Let's just get to the next system, shall we? This is a Gek system. Wait. I have a Gek charm to go trade before we leave. Bork Shack, baby Bork Shack. Hop in my shuttle. It's a 22 slot. <laughs> seen man bear pig in this game yet no but i saw a hippo dragon once it was amazing joshua still up here stream still working good good i think that was just my my own computer having a buffer no pirates on the way back i was actually disappointed just now that pirates didn't attack me i i want them to attack me all the time now <laughs> i want to fight pirates everywhere i go pew 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 i'm a space fighter I think I might go for a fighter ship instead of an explorer class and just build my warp upgrades on that and use that because I'm really curious now to see how those fighter ships maneuver, especially in S class. What are you doing? Don't pull your weapon out in a space station. That's not proper. <laughs> that just happened when I got out of my ship. Oh, that was the grenade glitch, but it wouldn't let me shoot because I'm in a space station. That's funny. Hello, everybody. Attendant Dobota. Eat your salad. Oh yeah, Sabjaz, thanks for the links. Those links in the chat from Nightbotter for the Gecknip Gang Discord, for anybody that doesn't know. Uh, that's where a lot of us meet up when there's no streams going to chat and group up in various games, but a lot of No Man's Sky streamers there as well, if you're ever looking for no, more No Man's Sky streams to watch. Multi-tool or exosuit blueprint? Uh, Multi-tool. Multi-tool. Ricochet Sigma? Who cares? You stink. Get out of here, Dilbota. Oh, I'm going to have to get that charm out of my ship. Here it is. Oh, I should sell these modules. Oh, I don't need to transfer them to sell them. I still forget that. My, oh my. Here you go. Here's a Gek Charm I found. Eat your salad. Oh, snap. Did I miss a notification in the chat there? Michael Better, thank you very, very much for your support with that donation. I didn't see a notification in the stream. It's supposed to come through the stream, but if we can get a hashtag for Michael Bedard in the chat, B-E-D-A-R-D, -E that would be most appreciated. He just uh, dropped a donation to the stream there. Excellent. Michael, thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Trade nanite clusters for blueprints. In fact, that reminds me. Oh, I only have 60 nanites now? That's all I got down there? I felt like I was picking up more. Let's go ahead and... Where are we? This is the planet we just finished, right? Yes. Let's name this one. For Michael Bedard's support. Thank you very much, Michael. Love it. Oh, uh. Boom. Let me double check the spelling on that real fast. I'd like to make sure it's right. Yes, that's it. 
Thank you, thank you. That's the planet we completed, and it's great. <laughs> awesome. Thanks, guys, for supporting it in the chat, too. Stream made you realize there are actually a lot more people who like this game than you thought? Good, Nurse Bo. Yeah, a lot of people would be surprised, because all they do is read Reddit and then repeat what they read without ever playing it or watching streams of it. So I'm glad that it's changed your mind or, or helped you realize that. Oh, and Scott Delaney. Yes, happy birthday, man. That's awesome. Happy birthday to Scott. All right. What are we doing? We got to sell some stuff, and then we got to get out of here. Get out of here. Iceman leaving too. Right on. Thanks for coming by, Iceman. Appreciate you. Good to see you. And we're going to sell Pugnium. And we're gonna sell. Oh, good, good prices on the neutrino modules. Sell this trophium, even though it's not a good price. Didn't use the resonator. Excellent. Let's buy up some basics. We need zinc and titanium restocked. We sure do. <laughs> Boom, bone junkie. Welcome to it, bone junkie. Were you here earlier? I forget. You've been quiet for a while. Or did I see you in another stream, and then I streamed? I forget. Either way, hi, Bone Junkie. <laughs> I'm going to buy the Heridium, too, since I'm rolling in dough. Yeah, Nurse Bo, relax. He's just a robot. He can't hurt you. <laughs> no Man's Sky rehype. That's right. That Gek is just yakking away in my ear. Titanium. Alright, shut up you Gek. Let's get out of here. Oh my goodness. Trade terminals. Uh, Nurse Bo, it's not possible for Nightbot to interrupt you. <laughs> it's a text chat. Good streaming earlier, Sav. Heck yeah, it was Bone Junkie. Bone Junkie on the Master Lurk plan. What kind of ship you got here? Ooh, a B-Class shuttle with the same amount of slots. And it costs more. Why? What's he got? Oh, he's got a phase beam? That doesn't impress me, sir. Show me a better, uh, better engine. Let's see if we can trade up for a better warp drive right now. Look at this yellow baby. Look at this banana, banana boat. <laughs> Talking about Gek salad recipes. Yeah, he is Moon Machine. Telling you all about the Akushneva. Do you think Gek's like blue cheese? They probably love it, Grover. <laughs> they probably love it to pieces. 23, that's one more slot for 635,000. No, thank you, sir. There's my ship. These guys are all laughing at my ship. I know it, but I don't care. I earned that ship. <laughs> It's not contaminated by interloper. That kills the price. <laughs> Ooh, 28 slot B class for 8.3 million. <sighs> Get your holler out of my face. Let's warp to another system. All the traders left. I should have bought some basics from those guys, but I didn't. Scott Delaney really wants me to reconfigure my multi-tool right now. But do I have the items? It's just iron for that, carbon for that, thamium, platinum, carbon. I probably do, don't I? Maybe I should repair another slot. I mean... Let's see. I could repair... How much for the bolt caster to move? Iron and plutonium? I've got that. Ship prices are absurd in perma? Yeah, Ivy Mike, they are. I'm not going to worry about the multi-tool for now. Sorry, Scott. <laughs> I don't know how I want to arrange it yet. There's things to consider. So, let's get on down the road. Let's 
see, this is 81. I can go a little further than that, can't I? 87. That was five planets, three planets, one moon, and too far. What about you? Five planets, one moon, 105, too far. What about you? Four planets, two moons, too far. All right, take me back to where I was. What about you? One planet, two moons. Ooh, I like the sound of that. Let's go. Off we go. Heck yes, heck yes. Thanks for joining everybody. Welcome to the new viewers once again. And shout out to everybody. You know, actually I was thinking earlier, I want to give a shout out to the people that seem to, uh, I don't know, I'd say there's roughly 20 people that are watching No Man's Sky streams regularly. And I don't think that many always chat. I think there's like roughly 20 people that aren't always chatting. So shout out to those guys for always being in chats because there seems to be still a nice core viewership of stream viewers. And it's, uh, it's really good to see. So to those that don't chat in these streams, I salute you as well. Because of course the chatters know I love having the company on the journey. This, these guys are in a group of three. This is a bigger battle. A bigger battle. What you doing, fellas? <laughs> Get him. Oh, oh, there he is. Oh, he doesn't like it. I shot your friend. Ah! <laughs> oh, feisty! Get back here! Get back here! I see you. Be my friend. You used to have other friends. Now I'm your only friend. Give me that. Where's the others? Show yourselves. Oh, there they are. Oh, oh. oh. There they go. Oh, who's shooting? Oh, they found me. Ah! Oh, oh, I see you. I see you. Let's go. Crash into you, ma. Ma. Boom. Oh, give me that trophy. That's right. Where are they? Here he is. Oh, don't shoot that freighter. Don't shoot, shoot that freighter. Come on now. Oh no. Where are they? Oh, it's getting hectic. This guy. Oh no. Flying through the freighter. I have to draw him out. I don't want to. I don't want to risk shooting that freighter, man. It's no bueno. There he is. Now I got one. Yeah. What do you think? What do you think is gonna happen? Don't fly by the freighter. You're endangering the lives of the people. Oh. Uh, the, the, Why won't it lock on? <laughs> Am I too close to this guy or what? Where is he? There it is. There's my target. Oh. 
plowing through that milestone. Man, I hope Moon Machine's still here. Sorry I can't keep up in the chat right now, y'all. I'm sure you understand. Gotta get away from that freighter, though. Not gonna shoot that freighter. No, sir. There he is. Yeah, shoot me down. Let's see what you got. There it is. Uh, there he goes. Turning a little funny there. Uh, uh. Get ya. Don't get ya. Give me that trophium, you punk. There it is. I see your trail. Oh, yeah. <laughs> These space battles have become so much more fun since I started doing them. <laughs> this is the best. Got that trophium. Where's the others? see his. What are you, just through the freighter? Where? Oh, I see him. Oh, here we go. Come around. What do you think of that? Do you like being shot at, mister? That's what you're doing. That's what you're doing out here. Oh, no. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, right in the freighter. There he is. There he is. Oh, stop it. Bouncing off the freighter now. We gotta get away from the freighter. We gotta get away from the freighter. I don't need to be bouncing off the thing for sure. Get out of here. Oh, that's that's traitors. Shoot the traitors. There's this guy, Dunzo. Good job, freighters. Don't shoot me, I'm flying through. Got the Lemium. Where is he? Come here, friend. Come here, guy. I'm the last of your kind, buddy. How does it feel? How does it feel? How does it feel? Oh, oh, oh. How does it feel? Ah. Uh. Boom. Oh. My lord. That is so fun. That is so satisfying, taking out all those ships. Woo doggies! How many spaceships is that milestone counter? Troublemaker! 20 starships! Now... Did you open up yet? Hold up. Land in the lead freighter and speak to the commander. What is, uh, what is missing from this picture? Oh, they're still closed. They're still closed. Let's go to the space station. We'll come back for this guy. They're still a little shaken up from the battle. We'll give them time to think it over. Ooh, doggy. I'll catch up on the chat in just a sec there. Oh, man, that was fun. Oh, ho, 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 boy, howdy. I love it. More pirates coming. Whatever. I'll get them on the way out. <laughs> oh, let's see. Nurse Bo just uh, just an off night bot, huh? Man, gotta shoot flashes first. What do you mean? What do you mean by that, Moon Machine? Oh, I was locked onto another one back there. Okay. Bone Junkie's feeling the urge to play. Glad to have you on my wing. <laughs> Hell yeah, Moon Machine. For real, if you guys haven't checked out Moon Machine's channel, go jo go look at his videos. He's got uh, two part, two videos that show how he went to uh, the 80, 80 ships destroyed milestone. That's the level 10 milestone for destroying ships with uh, the basic Rasa Mama, no upgrades. I'm, I'm rocking a shield upgrade and a photon cannon, or two photon cannon upgrades here so moon machine was doing it in the basic the stock ship the default ship with no upgrades it was incredible and that's where i learned everything i know about how to fight pirates in this game seriously was by watching that great tips in those uh videos and a great way to get a look at how to do it mike young welcome to the chat Gecknip gang welcome as well hallelujah welcome to the chat yeah hit refresh if you're having problems don't forget, and don't forget you guys, make sure you hit that live button once in a while to make sure it's not buffered. 
uh, on your video. Reassure with bolt caster or mining. I'm a miner. I'm a miner. I convinced the trader that I am to be trusted. It is hugely relieved. Boom. There's Geknip, Geknip Gang in the chat with a link to the uh, Moon Machines Rasa Mama Supreme Pirate. I call it the Master Course. I call it the Pirate Fighting Master Course. Because if he can get that whole milestone in the basic Rasa Mama, then, like he said many times, nobody should <laughs> have any troubles with anything. <laughs> well, with I mean, with fighting pirates, basically. Yeah, it can be done. That's the message that Moon Machine has brought us. And the Moon Nuver. That's where you drop in behind him like I was doing back there. We call it the Moon Nuver. <laughs> the Moon Nuver. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Those space battles are great. I never fully appreciated how wonderful those space battles are until I finally started doing them in permadeath. That's where it gets good. What a rush. Crolium. Lemium at a premium. Nice. And I have two. Those pirates had the best booty of all. Gyar. Hashtag booty. Now if only Moon could fix your bad aim, Mike Young. Well, <laughs> he can't do everything. <laughs> he can't play it for you, but he can show you how to do it with his videos. <laughs> uh, let's go talk to that freighter captain and get our reward. Uh, yar. Nice shuttle. How much? You got better warp drives on there? You got better warp drives? Limpsis. Ooh, 23 slaughter. For 635, it's a C class. I'm in a B class. Get you, get that, get out of here. There's an explorer over there. Chloe has the best booty, John Otter. You missing the Uncharted 3 tonight? Yeah, I had to play some permadeath. I was thinking about, I was getting ready to do Uncharted 3 for my stream, for my regular stream tonight. And uh, I just, I needed this space battle stuff right now. I needed that. All that aside, your piloting is excellent now. Great to see. Thank you, Moon Machine. High praise. High praise from the man. Have your own special move in pirate battles. It's called Miss by a Mile. Miss by a Mile? My God. <laughs> uh, Chloe has the best bow tie. That's right. Chloe got the best bow tie. I would say Aloy Gecknip Gang. <laughs> Listen, don't talk about Aloy's butt. Aloy is innocent and pure. What? Did they come back and start another fight? Well... Hold on. Yeah, and this guy's still closed down. Are you kidding me? Did I miss one? Is that why he was still closed? I don't see any diamonds on my radar. Hold on. Let's take a look. Space station, planet, moon. There's no diamonds on the radar. What are you fighting? Oh, I can't do that. Hold on. I think it's glitchy. Mike Young says Cindy. <laughs> yeah, Mike. <laughs> Cindy from Final Fantasy 15. Listen, I was talking about pirate booty, you know, Trisha. I don't know why you guys keep talking about girls from video games. Oh, there they are. Look at this horde after them, though. They got the horde after them. Yikes, oars. right into the freighter. I feel like I'm getting ripped off if I save this freighter again. I'm only going to get one reward, I bet. And that's going to bum me out a little bit. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's right, hostile ships approaching. Where'd it go? What's that? Oh, nice lasers. The game just really wants me to slip up and hit the crater so I can kill me, I know it. Shoot me, traitor, please. Oh, oh. Oh! Yeah, I'm really curious now. I gotta get a freighter, uh, fighter ship. I need to get a fighter ship and see how they... I bet they're so good at that maneuver. <laughs> That's what I feel like. Ooh, more Lemium. Alright. Where are they? Other side? Oh, so close to freighter. So close to freighter. I don't trust it. I think that was the last of my titanium. I'm down to zinc. Oh, look out! I gotta get away from this thing. Where's this guy? Oh no! Critical damage taken, they got me. Because I didn't charge fully that last time. Oh no! What's going on? Don't tell me shield down, it was like halfway. Am I locked onto the other one again? These other guys. I don't want to shoot them by accident. There we go. Just gotta get synced up with them. He's down. Chromium. Oh. Almost went for that traitor. Yeah, out, dude. Fly right into my bullets, and the sentinels will blame me. Bullets, photons, whatever. All right, all right. Are you gonna open up yet? This is really helping my standing with the Gek, though. Whew. There's another one. Mock tone, welcome to it. Boom. Nice. But freighters still. What are they shooting at? They're shooting at the traitor? They're blasting that guy. Why? Why? Yeah, what am I at? Oh man, I'm out of materials. I really need to stock up. I don't know what's going on with that freighter. Now they're shooting traitors. Look at all these traitors flying to the station though. It's awesome. Buy a bunch of titanium and zinc, y'all. <laughs> Used it all up. <clears throat> Come on, Star Fox. Thanks, Joshua. I will get two freighters. Okay. Don't help. John Otter's never gonna forgive Nightbot. <laughs> Trader must have shot freighter by mistake. Moon machine. Yeah, I didn't know that happened, but that seems like what happened there. Pretty weird, but that means they're occupying. I don't think he's going to open his his landing bay until that's all done. It takes him forever to take out a ship. Nightbot is a tool. Don't hate on Nightbot. Nightbot helps us by removing spammy links and excessive emojis. 
That's why there was a second battle, a second freighter group flew in. Oh, good. Oh, whoops, I meant to trade with you, not look at your ship. See you later, Scout. Thanks for coming by tonight. Appreciate you being here. Can't wait till the next update, Mock Tone. Yeah, should be good, huh? Uh, Zinc at a premium. No thanks. Titanium's at a good price here. Emoji movie's gonna be a masterpiece? Yeah, maybe. Maybe it will be a masterpiece. We just took off. Come back. Let's go see if they're open. Sometimes Warping Freighter gets a second attack of its own. Jesus. He's still close. They're still fighting him. But if I attack this trader ship, I'm not going to be helping the freighter. I'm going to get the Sentinels called after me. And see, there's no other freighters to land on. None of them have a docking. There was another set of freighters. Somewhere. This should be... Huh. Well, I don't know where those other freighters are. space station is either. I'm lost. I'm lost in space. Still orange. They're still fighting over there. I don't see any other freighter markers except for that one. I don't know. No fighting correct. Yes. You gonna be a geck for Halloween, John? Otter? Nice. That ought to be interesting. Take a pic. Share a pic of your costume. Looks like the fight is over. The captain is sulking. May have had his stray shots hit him. Well, I mean, these... Look at these ships flying around there. They look like they're up to something. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. I don't have shielding materials. I've got a little bit of iron. That's it. I'm not going to fight these guys right now. I should just get out of here. Oh, red dots. What was that? Why did they have skulls? Are those like super elite pirates that just flew in? What was the red skull and crossbones icon there? What? What? See you later, Caroline. Thanks for coming by. Use the crosshairs, Luke. Yeah, Scott Delaney, I was. I lined them up right in the crosshairs, but I didn't see them. Red Skulls are elites. Run. Yeah, yikes, dude. I don't know that I've ever seen elites before. So what is currently my most convenient source of plant farming? I actually don't do much of it, Joshua. I, uh, I have a video on my channel about uh, making insulating gel, what you need for that, and that kind of farm setup. Nip Nip is also pretty lucrative, but basically anything you can farm and sell at a premium is going to be good to farm. I mean, it's all, it's all income. Oh man, does the radio chatter in this game remind anyone else of Independence War? Don't know if I know that one, John Otter. Don't know if that signifies anything or if it's just the edge of the screen. No, that was that was a different icon, Moon Machine. That was like a skull and crossbones inside of a red circle that I've never seen before. That wasn't the regular icon for pirates. You're saying maybe just because they were off screen though? I don't know. Could be. Could be. I just don't even know. Nip nip is the new thing, yeah. Nip nip is very lucrative these days. It grows quicker than the insulating gel materials, but the insulating gel and the acids sell for the highest amounts. So it depends on how you want to farm, really. Best thing to farm is what you get star prices on? Yeah, Moon Machine, that's, yeah. Anything you can find premium in a system is worth growing. Generally. 
<laughs> Gecknip Gang takes 10% of the profits. <laughs> Boom. A little bit of titanium and zinc. I need to buy more. Bye, bye, bye. Baby. Nope. Premium zinc? Get out of here with that. I'm over a million units, though. That's great. You have fought Red Skulls many times, didn't notice a big difference? Okay. Okay. Look at that explorer. Samuel Fisher, thanks for coming by. We'll see you next time. Yeah, Moon is pretty elite. Maybe a little tougher, hard to tell. Moon's just being modest right now. He's like, yeah... I've fought the elites. They're not they're not that big of a deal. <laughs> Pirate killer. No, I believe it. I believe it's not that big of a deal for Moon Machine, for sure. Pro. Pro status. Ultimately, you'll do Nip Nip Joshua. All right, man, you got it figured out. There you go. People say you look like the moon because you're pale. Mock tone. Well, that doesn't sound very imaginative, but okay. I mean, on their part. I don't think I need to buy too much Heridium. I'm going to stop buying Heridium because I have a stack and a half. No, not quite a half. But still. Look at you, little bug. I'll just stand right next to your engines. That's That should be safe. Man, oh man. Zinc titanium. Oh, he's got the nip. Probably going to have to buy all four of these nips from him. That'll be good for my, my own farm. Found Nip Nip Star Price once in a permadeath you died in. That would have been bank. Yeah, it would, Moon Machine. Buddy, just... I need to... I need to stand on your ship for a moment. So that you don't leave. Oh, no, I need to sell this stuff. Hold on. Gotta juggle inventory now. Yeah, okay. I can buy four nip from him and then just go upstairs and sell that lemium and crolium. Didn't buy the nip. I know, Grover. That's why I stood on his ship so he wouldn't leave. I needed the room in my inventoire. It's even at a green price. 97,000 bucks on nip nip. Don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody. Uh, hello. Hello. No, I didn't just buy a bunch of Nip Nip. Ant Head Art, you on? Am I on? I'm on. Am I on? I don't know. Are you on? Is anybody on? Trophium. Chromium. And... Lemium. That premium Lemium is beautiful. I could just fight pirates here until the end of time and get rich off of Lemium. You fixed the volume and head. Oh. <laughs> yeah, volume troubles. Okay. Nip, 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 nip. Into my ship. Nip to my ship. Nip, nip. Nip it to my ship. Nip to my ship. Gonna do the dip. Fricky, fricky scratch. Yo, yo. Bang, bang. <laughs> Tonight, my favorite song is Love Shack. Yeah, there you go. I'm on, we're on. Prices are not what they used to be. Yeah, for sure, Ivy Mike, for sure. Things just ain't what they used to be around here. Unstable Plasma. Premium Karite Sheets. Wow. If you had an easy source of iron, it might almost be worth it. Probably not.
Nip is actually a very offensive word. Unsubbed and reporting the video. JK, mock tone. Oh, you got me. Can't wait till they put that buy all button in the game. That'll be great. Buy all. See, then I'd be done. Buy all. See, I'd be done. <sighs> Seriously, Nurse Bo, just don't worry about Nightbot. For real. Let it go. Let me and Crowley are good money anyway. Star Price makes a perfect system for fire killing and fun and profit. Yeah, for real, Moon Machine. This is a great system for it, right? Sentinel stuck between the hydroponic trays and your base. Nice, Joshua. Did I just rip out a B-52's reference and head art? Yeah, you missed it earlier. I was doing a whole parody based on... It was, it was a No Man's Sky Love Shack parody. It's getting all crazy up in here. Just wild. Two plutonium. What? Two. But I mean, let's see. If I warp back to my base, I can save this system on my teleporter list. But then, I'm gonna be that much further away from the next Atlas interface. Which I'm almost to now. I don't know. Or a craft all button? Yes, Joshua, yes. Yeah, I don't know. Should I leave the system or should I stick around? Why is all the zinc premium though? Every single one of these guys. Am I been talking to the same guy over and over? Is that what's going on? This isn't the same ship that I was just talking to. It's a different ship. I'm torn. I don't know if I should stay and fight pirates for money. How far along on that uh, milestone are we now? We're at five. We've gone up two milestones. Next milestone in seven. Well, let's go see if the freighter opened up. We've got a little bit of shielding material. We've got a good amount of, a goodly amount of titanium. How's our plutonium doing? Started a new stack of plutonium. That's great. Great. I should take this nip nip to base though, the geck nip to my base. Love Shack used to be the Muzak station when you worked at KB Toys in high school. Wow, Ivy Mike, I remember KB Toy Stores, where a kid can be a kid. Entire genre of music ruined for me. <laughs> yeah, listening to stuff at work, uh, not by choice, is uh, a real good way to ruin some music. Still orange. Still orange because they don't actually destroy ships. The freighters don't destroy the ship, or if they do, it takes so friggin' long. I'm still orange. Okay, who's shooting? I heard it. I'm tempted to just blast whatever traitor this fighter is still battling. This freighter. Fighter. I'm going to warp back to base. I'm going to call it a loss on any kind of rewards from that freighter. Whoop. Got it. Be a pirate. Yeah, or I could go attack that freighter myself, huh? Nah, then it's stealing the sentinels, wanted levels. I don't know if I'm ready for that, John Otter. Get me 
dabs. <laughs> oh my goodness. A bunch of more traders have landed there. I'm gonna talk to them on my way to the teleporter. I should be checking the value on these ships too. Because now that I've got my ship repaired, it is time to start trading up. It is time to start trading up, and I'm at a million units right now, which is a great time to trade up. But if I'm going to trade up, I need to go for either a better warp drive or a better class, a fighter or an explorer. I need, a, I need to trade up to either a better warp drive or a fighter or explorer. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hold out for that. Busy station, this is a great system. Yeah, Moon Machine, you're digging it. <laughs> I'm trying not to get attached. <laughs> Premium resonators from this guy. It is a good system. Oh, nine plutonium. Oh, I forgot to I forgot to ask. C class shuttle, no sir. Uh, let's check this explorer. Explorer is dangerous for pirate fighting for health. Yeah, moon machine. Okay, maybe I should uh, discount the explorer then. I'll just go fighter. Fighter's gonna have less inventory space though, right? Buy stuff on my freighter. I don't have a freighter ant head. Not in permadeath. Oh, he's got the nip. Oh. Hireling Nira. Hireling Nira. Oh, I'm gonna buy so much nip. It's gonna be great. Running out of room. I really need I need to take it all back to base. Now's as good a time as any. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Before I start talking to every single traitor in the whole universe. In the entire universe. Haulers are good when you only have one ship. You get a warp bonus, shield bonus, eight health and slots. Really? But how are they for fighting? How are they for fighting though, Moon Machine? Party at Mike's base. That's right, Ivy Mike. Right on, Nurse Bo. We'll see you next time. Boom. Back to base. Yay, yay, yay. What an adventure out there. I love the space fighting. I'm just so into it now. It's so great. <laughs> so choice. digging it hope you guys are enjoying yourselves too don't forget to hit that like button if you haven't already and if you're not subscribed yet i hope you'll consider that as well i do like to stream the no man's sky also been doing uncharted the original trilogy remastered in the nathan drake collection lately uh eso diablo little of this little of that some nba playgrounds lately just for those sweet dunks you know so feel free to check those out on the channel too everything's all broken out into playlists for you so, hello farm. Hello empty planter. Did I not plant spadonium yet? I never did. Did I still need something to plant spadonium? I don't remember. But let's do that. I thought I planted spadonium. No, I didn't. I totally spaced off planting the spadonium, y'all. I might not have had the necessary stuff at the time. Which way? How about this way? There's my spadonium plant. Hello, Tamarium. Hello, Nip Nip. It's great. My little farm here. It's lovely. I almost don't want to expand it, but I will. But I will. Back to the future. The condor isn't bad. I manage, says Moon Machine. Okay. 
More trouble through lack of HUD than ship issues. Yeah, Moon Machine. I don't know about HUDless still. Oh. It's intense, man. It's intense. Mordite. Sack Venom. Gravitino Ball. Oops. Oh, I remember what I was going to do. Um, no, that wasn't it. What was I going to do? Sack Venom, Gravitino Ball, Nip Nip. Oh, now I have... Yeah, that's right. It's getting all out of order. You're out of order. I'll just put those back. It's fine. Everything's fine. Now, if I was going to expand this, how much does it cost to build the dang old... That's not in there. Where's the biodomes? Do I have to buy the plants first for my guy? I was hoping to build some biodomes. Then I was going to call Polly Shore. Stephen Baldwin. Hey, buddy. Oh, I keep pushing X. Why? Have to guess which one to shoot? Yeah. Yikes, Moon. In case I haven't told you lately, thanks, Mike, for what, John Otter? You're welcome, probably, but I don't know what I'm... you're welcoming you for. How much does it cost to buy titanium glass and suspension fluid? Five pieces of glass? These are expensive. Boy! Plus 66,000 units for the plan? Boy. Freighter battles are chaotic without that lock? I bet. So I'm not going to buy... It'll be a while before I do any biodomes like I was thinking. But... Uh-oh. Need more iron. Let's go find some iron. Oh, hello, Almond Gene Dewey. Let's see, iron over by these caves, yeah? Yeah. Nice. Sentinels reporting for duty. What is it? Nice. A little bit more. <laughs> Bye. Oh, where am I? Man. Do a little bit of farm expansion in the old base here. It's great. I'd like to move these, but do I get the materials back? Like, if I delete a planter, what happens to the plant? Is it just lost? Or do I get the materials back? I could plant it again. Oh, I don't dare to try it without knowing. Maybe you guys can tell me in the chat. Can you relocate a planter like that? You get it all back, Moon Machine? Great. I trust you. Where's farming? Tamarium. Yeah, nice. 
Well, that's good. That's really good to know. If they go multiplayer, I'm buying PS4 because I can't think of a group of people I'd rather be chilling in space with than a get nip gang. Right on, Ivy Mike. That'd be awesome. Maybe you should buy a PS4 anyway. Just harvest before you delete, and you did. Good. Okay, cool. Awesome, awesome. This guy. There we go. Have a wall of nip. Except, what's in here? This is my sack venom. Put it over there. There we go. And then this will all be the nip. And I would need a bunch more Rygogen and my Gek nip. Nope, Rygo's in here. How much Rygo do I have left? 318, I can plant three more. I can plant three more of my nips. And I have a stack of three. One, two, three. And then I have three more planters ready to plant. Boom, but that's four nip nip plants now. That's great. Oh, that's great. <clears throat> oh, Grover, you used that Let Go app. Interesting. I've seen it, but I've never used it. Good to know that uh, you had a good experience, though. Kill a plant, get hack. <laughs> oh no. Oh man. Puffball, I agree. Geknip are my family. That's right, Moon Machine. That's right. And for those watching from the future or in the chat right now, don't forget there's a link in the description to the Geknip Gang Discord server. That's where a lot of us uh, will be found chatting it up, hanging out when there's no streams going on. Wait a second. Did that use any of my Rygogen? What? I can plant more. Hold on. I still got a bunch of Rygo. I thought I was going to use it up. But, if I didn't... Oh, 10 Rygogen. Why did I think 100? I was thinking 100 Rygogen. I misread. That's my bad. I'm a fool. I have plenty of Rygogen, then. That means I can uh, build a couple more planters. Why was I thinking 100? That's ridiculous. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, I know what I need to do. I've got two more nip. So I can build two more planters. Oh, I'm out of iron. Hold on. Let's go get some more. If you all start playing Boundless, it is cross-platform. What's Boundless, Ivy Mike? I don't think I've heard of that one. Boundless. That's a good name for a cross-platform game, though. I get it. I see what they did there. Give me all that iron, iron. Oh, really? Yep, there's the grenade glitch. Good thing I did a test shot. Nip, nip. There, that's all the Geknip that I got out there. 
That's all of it. Hub a D, hub a D, hub a D. That's all, folks. Right? Boy, this farm has really expanded today. Woo! My goodness. Coming along here at old Almond Gene Dewey Base. This is not where my Rigogen goes. I should play Player Unknown's Battlegrounds. Ah, Captain Juice, that's not really my type of game, I think. New solar flare shield gear for real. John Otter, is it is it blasting us again? Yeah, I've watched some uh, Player Unknown Battlegrounds streams, and I mean, I, I see what would be fun about it, but it's the kind of game that I would get bored with pretty quickly, I think. I changed my mind on something here. I'm gonna just plant myself. Oh, oh, I'm out of thamium. Duh. I was gonna plant one more. <laughs> That's alright. Later then. Running low on thamium though. Look at that. Farm expansion completed. So much nip. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, four, one, two, three, four, five. Nine. I've got nine nip nip plants. Ah, ah, ah. That's great. I like my little farm. Enough to take a picture. That's a nice expansion for the farm today. Base is coming along for perma. Yeah, for real. Ivy Mike, I'm digging it. Let's see if we can... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I should really get a shot when everything's bloomed, too. Four more than yourself, damn me! Well, Moon Machine, you gotta find a system where they sell it. In the... in the station. <laughs> that is really handy. That is a good system. It's good for pirate fighting because of the premium lemium. It's a place to buy nip nip, which you can just grind out the lemium and keep getting money for the nip nip. That's a great system. Let's go fight some more pirates. <laughs> Shall we? Give it a save. You got shrooms aplenty though, Moon Machine. Nice. And we'll go back to Ayakun Gamqua Kukwa Kuka. Yeah, it took out Dang Marino. Oh, that's where we flew from, though. That's we flew away from Dang Mar Dang. What was it? Dang Main Row. Dang Main Row. Never heard the final assessment of Overwatch. Not as boredom-inducing as I thought. Any chance I'll get it? Laz, I did really enjoy that free weekend. Of Overwatch, I don't think I'm gonna buy that game. Uh, I think a free weekend once in a while is great for it. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna go out and buy that one. I enjoyed it. I had a good time with you and AC Gamer. It was great having the uh, the advice while we played. That made it a lot more fun, I think, than if I was trying to figure it out for myself. Gonna head off now. Plasma Blitz, thanks for hanging out with us for, during the stream tonight. Appreciate you being here. Don't forget to hit that like button on your way out if you haven't already. Hopefully we'll catch you next time. And welcome to the new viewers rolling in too. Thanks for joining us on Gaming Mike's channel tonight. Dang Marino, the Dolphins quarterback. <laughs> That's right, Moon Machine. Yeah, I knew it wasn't Marino. I just... Main row, Marino. Dang, Marino laces out. 
Dang. Isotoner gloves. Dang. Trade Envoy Limpsis. Oh, I remember. I talked to this guy already once. What do you have? Nothing. You got negative inventory. Get out of here. Limpsis. You're going to be limpsising out of here. Oh, 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 oh. Look at this. He's got Warp Reactor Sigma, but it's a C-Class! Ah! It's only 35,000 units, but he's got the Warp Reactor. But he's got the... Oh, no. I don't want to go down a class. No, I'm not going to go down a class in ship trading, even for a warp drive. I'm not going to do it. Plus, I really want a fighter. <laughs> Which is this big guy? Uh, titanium, good. Spoiler alert, Finkel is Einhorn. Einhorn is Finkel. Finkel, Einhorn, Einhorn, Finkel. <laughs> Classic. Look at this fighter, though. Should take it. Never see that these days. With the warp reactor? Are you serious? I'm not going to go down a class, though. No. What do you mean you never see that these days? I thought that was... I thought that was the way. I thought you could still buy ships with warp drives. Is this system just that magical? You guys are making me regret it. It was only 35,000, too. And he's gone. He's gone. Oh, I forgot to make an offer on Specialist Tojor's ship. It's a C-Class. No bueno. What do you mean you never see that these days, though? I thought warp drives still appear... I mean, that's how I did in creative mode. That's how I got my upgraded warp drives, was just from trading ships. Seen it in perma on crash ships. Warp upgrades fitted are rare. Well, shit. I just passed one up for 35,000. That's alright. That's alright. I'll pray to the RNG gods. Uh, basic, yeah. That, that fighter ship it was way basic. Gotta give it a save. The second you do a B or A class warp drive ship will roll up. Yeah, Joshua, wouldn't that just be the way? Wouldn't that just be the way? Dang, main row. Transmission tower for a crashed ship. I don't want that. Thought you were going to get a freighter so you could have multiple ships. Yeah, that's... I'm a ways off from a freighter, though. I'd like a fighter before then. Just so I can blast these pirates better. <gasps> Manufacturing facility. I'm going for it. I need that. Main row? Gonna need a bigger farm, yeah. <laughs> Definitely, Ivy Mike. I don't see them much. I would have taken. I wouldn't have taken it either. Not for a lousy sigma. Yeah. Okay. Now I feel better. Not the transmission tower. Dang main row. I can't stop saying it, even though I'll probably never see that system again. Dang arena. Ooh. Hold on. Pirates are coming. Got lots of titanium. Stack it up. Some zinc. Oh, mostly harmless. Where'd you go? There it is. I see ya. I see ya. It is to say I saw ya. Hundred grand. Hundred grand, brah. I'm coming to get ya. I'm gonna get ya. Bounty. There is. Let's go, buddy. Got pirate. What 
you got mostly harmless. Wanna fight me? You don't want to fight me? You gonna shoot the asteroids in your frustration? It's fine. Do that. Give me your hundred grand. There it is. Nice. I love it. Standing with the Gek has increased. Where's my Gek standing now? Must be. Oh, one more to collaborator. One more before I can stop, collaborate, and listen. See you later, Captain Juice. Thanks for coming by tonight. Unplug all of my gear tonight. Wow, John Otter, you're really worried about this one. Keep a junker for black holes. Yeah, that would always be handy. Four to five hours until it hits. John Otter's getting worried, y'all. Still haven't left your home system because of those two nice lush planets. Joshua, nice. Hey, Mick T... Uh, Mick JT... T, JT, that's right. It's JT, not TJ. Nick JT, welcome to the chat. <laughs> I doubted myself as I started saying it. Manufacturing facility, where is it? Where's the landing beacon? There it is. Got it. Oh, blasted atmosphere. Maprin Gato Flats. What type of cat is a Maprin cat? Is that Spadonium? Hey, sup, Spadonium? I'll take it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at those killer cacti. I didn't see the uh, fauna here. Was there none? I'm not hearing any. Yep, no animals to worry about. That's good. Because otherwise I might be tempted to stay and finish it off. Keep on thinking Nightbot's a Walmart ad with that blue and yellow. <laughs> Ivy Mike. Yeah, I can see it. I can see it. Makes sense. Got to scan some plants and rocks. Protection Ooh, more spadonium over there. Nice, nice. Oh, let me in. Uh oh. Wow. Oh, there they go. Now they care. <laughs> I was like, wow, they don't really care. But they do. The word for temperature. Okay, let's see about this. Going to re-download this. Laik Mohammed, welcome to the chat. That's awesome. That's awesome if you're going to... Alt name is Lunar Contraption Moon Machine. <laughs> I like that. Coronal mass ejection is actually perilous. Could fry power across the nation. Yikes. Man, you guys are worrying me about this solar flare stuff. Something high temperature. Engage coolant chamber network. There's suspension fluid, finally. 
I've been putting this off going to a manufacturing facility. Now I can make warp cells from scratch. I don't have to buy suspension fluid anymore, even though... not It's not that buying suspension fluid is a hard thing or anything. It's definitely not. What's this little cactus? Oh, that's the stump of a spadonium plant. Uh. Oh, haven't scanned that cacti yet. Whoops. Well, grenade glitch took care of that carbon whip for me. Look at this barren tree. Oh! I don't think I've ever seen one quite so thin and scraggly. That is the thinnest, scraggliest tree I think I've ever seen in the game. With a little leafy base. Wow. Nice. Everything looks the same. Everything looks the same in this game. I played it for 10 hours. And I know that everything looks the same. Sorry, I was thinking about those people. <laughs> did I scan these? Yes, I did. Blasted atmosphere. I bet the storms on this planet are nasty. Nasty like Miss Jackson. Nasty. Who would like a flats on this hot, dusty planet named after them? Be the first one to say I do in the chat, and I will name these flats after you. X-ray flux. Want to find any 40-something slot hauler so you can seek it crashed. Okay. Moon machine. Gotta try no HUD sometime. Yeah, Mick JT, someday. 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 Ivy Mike wants it. He got it first. Oh, but it is Scott Delaney's birthday. It is Scott Delaney birthday. Ivy Mike, I hope you don't mind. I'm gonna give this one to Scott. I forgot it was his birthday. Scott Delaney Flats. Boom. I don't, says Nimrod with a down under smiley face. I like it. Ivy Mike, I figured you wouldn't mind. Appreciate it. Yeah. Get one for Scott Delaney for sure. Love it. Always good to have you guys along in the chat, though. You know. You know I appreciate it. Let's fly to space and see if there's any more pirates. After I upload these. Rocks and things. Where are we sitting on units? That was 10,000 units. We're at 1,000,000. 87,000. Nice. Should have called it birthday flats. <laughs> that would have been funny, Grover. Ah, that would have been good. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking that far. Oh, nanites. Spadonium. Oh, can I even take off? Oh, crap. Oh, yeah, because we have tons of plutonium. <laughs> love it. I love it when there's tons. Oh, plus we're at a landing beacon, derp. Okay. Back to space. Incoming storm. In space? Why, I think now. Wow, wow, look out. <laughs> Dang, main row. I didn't rescue you. You've got nothing for me. Where's the station? It's over there. Transmission towers right behind it. Or is this not the station? Oh, the station's over right on the other side of the planet, I think. Still could use some health boxes. Yeah, Grover, I do need to keep an eye out for those for sure. I was hoping there would be one in that facility, but there was not. But yeah, I'm still down at two health, right? I didn't look while I was down there. Oh, go the other way. What? 
Pirates. Oh, another one. I wasn't even looking at my scanner. Where is he? There he is. Is he on planet? Is this guy on the planet? Does that happen too? Or is he coming up? Do they start on a planet and then fly off of it? Is that what's going on? I don't know. He's just really close to it. units credited to my account that's the best job to have in space just blast guys out of the sky I'm sitting here waiting for their farms to pop and watching Mike stream oh yeah Joshua farmer life moon has chased them down in the atmosphere nice yeah I've seen some some shots of people fighting pirates in the atmosphere of planets and I think I did it once long ago before updates back in the old days before I refound my love of pirate fighting on permadeath here. Rediscovered. The love. Dang, Monroe. We name a toad after you, daughter. <laughs> Next time I find one, if I remember. Atmosphere combat is actually super easy. They suck planet side. Yeah, Moon Machine, if I remember correctly, they don't really fight back when you're down in the planet side. But I don't know if that's changed since updates either. Sales got Kessman. Give me your zinc, Sales Gek. John Otter using the first spawn voice. <laughs> Oh, I forgot. We're in the we're in the market for ships too. Thirty five. See, this one costs. That warp upgrade Sigma wasn't even the reason it was more price. This one's thirty five thousand. One slot less. I don't remember how many slots was on that last one I saw. I didn't check the slots. I think it was twenty two also though. Oh, here's Limpsis. Twenty five slot B class for one point seven. That's three more slots than I've got. That would be nice. I want one of these with a warp upgrade. That's what I want. 25 slot shuttle though. Does anybody know the max slots on shuttles? I don't know what the max is for a shuttle. Or rather, what is the most slots you've ever seen in a shuttle class since Pathfinder update? Akushneva! Kushnava to you, Gek. I have Trophium. I have Crolium. Oh, I don't think I got any Lemium out there this time, though. Nope. Bummer. <laughs> Too complainy for you, John Otter. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Cracking me up. 48 slots like no I don't think it's 48 slots for shuttle class after the Pathfinder update they changed it and each each class of ship I think has a different max slots haulers are the only ones that go up to 48 now I believe unless I'm wrong but I'm pretty sure that's the case anyway I do have to wrap it up to there I want to thank you guys so much for joining me tonight for my regular stream I stream Monday Wednesdays Fridays at 9 p.m. Mountain Standard Times that was about three hours ago we're almost there uh, but I'm going to call it good for here. We had a lot of good pirate fights tonight. We upgraded our farm finally in the base, back at base. Uh, my ship is all maxed out. My multi-tool is coming along. It's going well in permadeath. This was stream number 30. 
Now, most of my permadeath streams are one hour. This one ended up being three because I did it for my main stream tonight. And uh, it was worth it. Got a lot done. Really enjoyed it. Glad to have you guys along in the chat as always. Thanks to the people who watch but don't chat. I don't know who you are, but I appreciate your viewership as well. Don't forget to hit that like button on your way out if you haven't already. Subscribe for more in the future. And we'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.